Hey guys, I'm gonna show you something interesting here in uh, Stonetown on Zanzibar Island. Should be on the way back, thanks, buddy. So here it is guys, this is the birthplace of Freddie Mercury from Queen, pretty cool. We're going to do a little walk through here, walk around the neighborhood here. Biggest pet peeve is you got these tourists that just stop right in the middle of the uh, right in the middle of the alleys blocking everybody through. <laughs> I'm gonna do what I do every time here, just kind of walk around, no GPS, just kind of get lost, get away from all this uh, kind of touristy around Freddie Mercury's home here, but see if we can find some uh, some gems. So like I said, the further you get deeper into the streets here, uh, less becomes less touristy. <laughs> Something I wanted to share with you, if you notice some of these doors here, how uh, they're still hand carved. Some of these doors are hundreds of years old and some of them are still made to this day. I'm gonna show you an example of uh, the Indian doors that they have, which have these kind of big spikes on them. And the purpose of those spikes were to keep from elephants ramming through them. This is years ago. I think they're more decorative now, but they're very beautiful. Oh, 
So Zanzibar is also known as uh, Spice Islands. So a lot of spice being sold around here. Lots of nice smells. Like I said, the more you get away from Freddie Mercury's house, the more white folk you see and the more authentic it gets. So I want to get away from that area and uh, into the area where it's a little more interesting. Check out the intricate detail on these doors. All hand carved. No CNC here. Vanessa and I were talking earlier and it reminds us both of Morocco around the Medina area but a lot cleaner like these buildings are very old but fairly clean at least compared to Morocco
we were out a few hours ago and it was like insane. We had both the kids and uh, it was so crowded. It's a little less people on the streets here. It's nice. Now here's what I was talking about these uh, these doors here. Very cool. It's like a mosque. Bahora Mosque. Check out some more information when I get back on the internet reception. I also wanted to take the chance to clarify something here because I get asked this question a lot during my videos and people often ask me, they say, do you feel safe? Look at some of the places that you go to, especially with your children. And out of 43 countries, I'll tell you the most dangerous place that I've been to is the United States of America. People in Canada will drive over the border to Detroit, spend the day, and then uh, be astonished that you're in Asia or in Africa or wherever, Middle East, now keep in mind how many uh, violent crimes are going on in the States. And for the most part, other than maybe petty theft, not really much goes on around here. And I feel extremely safe. Uh, yeah, my safety is, uh, is obviously a concern, but I wouldn't go into any places that were unsafe. So here I am. Look at this door. Isn't that awesome? Got to think about how much history just around these streets here. Look at that. Awesome. And Stone Town is a UNESCO heritage site. Hey, brother. Is there a market around here? Market. Market. Him? Oh, well, he's on the phone. I won't bug him. <laughs> That's all good, brother. Just gonna keep walking. So this is the dock here where um, the boats come in from mainland to uh, Zanzibar here. This is where we first came in. It was crazy. We actually pull up, pulled up in our taxi cab and before we pulled up, they're scratching at the doors and they're just trying to get at your luggage cases. 
Um, obviously, they want tips, right? They're just trying to make a living out here, but it's a, it's a madhouse. You've got about literally 50 people rushing at you. Good morning, my brother. How you? <laughs> Good, how are you? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Such cute little kids everywhere you go. Really are. It's another one of these doors. That definitely is not IKEA built. You can really get lost in these streets here. They just, there's no um, shape or whatever to them. They're just literally zigzagging all over the place and little alleyways. And
Hello. Hello. How are you? Still around, huh? What's that? You're still around, you're closing, yeah? Yeah, I'm just trying yeah, to go so back. Yeah, I still don't got to share. Maybe it's yeah. oh, yeah. Help for your size. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm okay for sure, my brother. Yeah, Appreciate so it, man. You got some nice stuff, like though. from here, man. <laughs> yeah, oh, you're from, I'm from Canada. I'm from Canada. 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 I am. Which part? Ontario. Montreal. No, Toronto. Near Toronto. Two hours in Toronto. Oh, okay. Yeah. Still like your home. My name? Yeah. Admin. Admin. My name is Ray. Yeah. Much okay. love to you, nice brother. To see you. Yeah, nice to see you. All right, guys, as usual, hope you enjoyed my videos. Hit that subscribe button and feel free to share my stuff. It means a lot to me. Thanks very much. See you next time.